To sharpen convex edges, you need a leather strop or strop bat. These are from are from JRE. This is a this is a custom from JRE, and this is a custom uh, bench strop from JRE. Uh, they're not going to be making these any longer, uh, but you can get the custom sizes of any length that you want. Uh, and uh, I'd recommend getting a little bit longer than the standard one, and ask if you can get it custom loaded with uh, black and green on each of the two on two black and two green sides. I think that gives you the best combination for sharpening. One of the most important things about sharpening your edge is setting the initial angle. Uh, what I do is you set the knife flat on your strop, slowly rotate it up, the spine up, while gently pushing forward until the, until the blade bites into the leather. You really want to use the end of the strop because it will slowly destroy that section of leather because you're, you're actually cutting it. But this gives me the edge, that, well, that's where it bit, so I know that that is the exact edge. With stropping, you don't need to be exact uh, with your angle. You can be you know, a few degrees off. It's not like uh, using stones where you have to be very precise. If you're off by you know, one or two or three degrees, uh, you're gonna be fine. Once you set the angle, then you pull back and you move the blade across And what you do is you do this 10 times on one side and then you flip over to the other side. And again, you set the knife flat, you rotate up, and that's where it went a bit, that's my angle. You repeat this back and forth 10 times per side until you get the edge that you want. Once you have a sharp knife, if every time you use it, uh, if, you know, if you're going out for uh, you know, camping for the weekend or you're, you know, use it hard for a day, uh, you really only need to do it uh, 10 or 20 times per side and you should have your hair popping edge back. If you want to then, you can go to the green compound and you repeat the process. When you sharpen a convex edge, it's important to keep the blade perpendicular to the, to the strop. It's also important to use a very soft touch when you're sharpening. Uh, you don't need any more pressure than just the weight of the knife itself, or just a, I mean, just a hair more. This is the, the food bar. Uh, I'm going to use this to show you the combination of uh, using the setting your angle, the soft touch, and rotating the edge. You set your angle, setting it flat, rotating up while pushing forward. Once you have the angle, you pull back, and when you get to the, the tip, you rotate it so you sharpen the knife all the way to the edge. This knife has an asymmetrical edge. Uh, it's designed as a pry bar, so there's different angles on both sides. That's where it becomes more important to set your angle.